Young, a neighborhood in southeast Fort Wayne, hosted a block party today. The goal? To celebrate progress in the area and shape a vision for the future. News Channel 15's Kaitor Paso has more on how and why they're dreaming big. The Mount Vernon Park neighborhood has four priorities they focus on to better their neighborhood. Beautification, recreation, social gatherings, and infrastructure. Today, they celebrated recreational success with the opening of a pallet park. The Mount Vernon Park neighborhood is dreaming big to become the best it can be. Their new park, made of pallets, was designed and built by the kids and adults who live there. And so when we call it a community park, it's not just a park that's in our community, it's a park that was built of and for our community. Community leader Raina Bradley says she can't get enough of watching the kids play. Just joy. Just pure joy. It's awesome to see them enjoying the fruits of their own labor, you know, and seeing, I guess, what they themselves can accomplish. Tenth grader Larisha Bryant Coleman says it was a messy project, but well worth it. I feel really accomplished because I see kids around here playing, and I'm like, I built this park for you guys. I had a hand in this community, and I make kids happy now. Kids like Demarcus Ryle, who are calling the new park a lot of fun. His favorite part. The monkey bars because I like like just running on the monkey bars and like jumping on them and stuff and which I like so I climb stuff. Bradley says the park is a symbol of the neighborhood's overall growth. One part of what we do is we try to shift the perception of this community. I think a lot of people think of Southeast and they think of it as a place that's not so great and that's staying that way and that's stagnant and we want our community members to see that this is a place that can grow, that can evolve, that can change and that they're really the ones who can make that happen. Plans are already in the works for another neighborhood park which will open next summer. In Studio 15, Kaitor Pessoa, News Channel 15.